And an upstate World War II veteran was granted a dream he's had nearly his entire life. It all happened Sunday afternoon in Greenville. Take a look. Buckled in, 96-year-old George Reitmeyer takes it all in. World War II Army vet with an honor flight Sunday afternoon from Veterans Last Patrol. Veterans Last Patrol is a nonprofit that looks after veterans that are in hospice care, end of life care. We call it the Last Patrol. We focus on friendships, honor ceremonies, and emergency systems. Reitmeyer had a dream. Veterans Last Patrol responded. Taking off from Greenville Downtown Airport in a Stearman training aircraft, the primary trainer for World War II pilots. High above Greenville before coming back in. Hopping out. Really, George? I'm at a round of applause for this World War II veteran. There's a mirror uh, right underneath the left of uh, the upper wing, and I can see the mirror from my seat, and so I see his face and he could see my face. And I love that there's, that's probably the best feature of this airplane is I can see the smiles and I can see the tears coming in their eyes. They can then see tears coming out of my eyes. As a young boy in Buffalo, New York, Reitmeyer always wanted to fly in this plane, yet $8 a ride, he could never afford it. And I've been thinking about that ride for 96 years and I finally took it. So that's, that's the dream flight of my life. And if we continue to serve and treat veterans that have served in a very special way, I think it's more likely that the future generation of Americans will be willing to step up and serve. You gotta love that.